now I'll wiggle the black wire and check out that lug. Yeah, that's pretty solid there. Good morning. We are going back at it today on a beautiful Wednesday. Here with my coworker Nate. Say hi, Nate. What up? So we're gonna be going over to Pleasant Hill. We got a couple main feeders to go and refeed for a service, uh, a couple wires burn up. And we got a little a couple of miscellaneous things to fix up around the house. And until then, we're gonna go get some material and we'll be back at the job site here soon. See you guys in a little bit. And we are currently back at Pleasant Hill. Looks like Nate got a head start on ripping out the sub panel inside the garage. We are gonna be refeeding it from the old setup into a new Siemens panel. What we had originally before was a main feed breaker that was coming right in and two breakers that were being triple fed off of each other. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take the old one, replace it with the new improved. Gonna get some a little bit more space in there. Now this little messy setup. Gonna be making this a little bit bigger so that way we can recess it in the wall, refeed it, get it taken care of. And in that meantime, this meter on the outside, we're gonna be pulling it apart here a little bit whenever Medam comes to disconnect power. We're gonna get refed into new wires into the basement where the panel is and get that power restored. So this is the panel we are going to be refeeding. See how that's burned up right there. Ooh. That side's not. But wiggle that red wire and check out that lug. Oh, yeah. And now I'll wiggle the black wire and check out that lug. Yeah, that's pretty solid there. Yep. So, so I'm kind of wondering if it's loose or what's going on. That's probably my original diagnosis of it being loose. So. With that being said, I'm going to have to be really careful with it. You can see where somebody ate up that uh, the straight head on yeah. that. Because that's a uh, weird main on it. So, I'm going to be looking at that, getting that replaced. This is why you always double check your orders. I was ambitious, thinking that it was going to be a good order, but um, was not. So, stay tuned, guys. And enjoy the show. side note where you couldn't see down in the basement before this is all nice and crispy all because the main lug was not attached correctly so that's why you always want to hire somebody who knows what the heck they're doing and actually get it connected correctly that's what nate's got going on so far looks like he's doing an awesome job getting that reconnected we got it reconnected right in the first place we're going to make it an actual true single phase coming in here now and we got a neutral hooked up, so once we get this fired up and running, it'll be actually appropriate. So, don't know what you've seen before, but obviously yes. wasn't able to show you. Uh, right in here, there wasn't enough connections, right connections, but we ended up making this right, made it look pretty. And now we are on the precipice of going through and fixing all these open air splices and getting it reduced down to three lights instead of multiple lights are not needed. All right, guys, we're going to go and take a quick lunch break. Go grab a couple of supplies that were uh, shipped to us wrong. So we're going to get that taken care of. We will be right back. All right, guys, we are currently back. We are going to be finishing up the rest of the garage uh nate's going to be doing that real quick while i go around uh in the basement getting some odds and ends sorted out as soon as we get that done go and do our last checkups make sure everything's working properly and then uh, we'll collect payment and we will be heading on out for the day pretty much it for now let's get started back up in this Yeah, 
yeah, guys. So, light, light, and light. All looks pretty spiffy. He is currently checking for power over here. That's the same as the other one. Okay. We got garage door. Yep. We got spare. We got lights. And we got other spare. All right. Well, I mean, it is an operation, so good, good. Get it marked up. Nice, pretty little panel. Good deal. And with that, as you can see, as if it was brand new. But yeah, looking good. And then we will take a trip on the basement and everything else and show you what we all did down there as well. That concludes everything. And GFI. Slow sewing fan. It's all for the moment. All right, guys. Sorry about that. You didn't really miss much. Uh, just missed out on the customer. He had to leave real quick, but we collected payment. We got the job done today. Uh, we went through, made sure the uh, basement was trimmed out. Uh, I'd show you a little bit more, but battery ended up dying midway. And so therefore, uh, wasn't able to go and show you a whole lot. But nonetheless, we got the basement done. I got a ceiling fan up, got the breakers in, got power restored to the rest of the basement. All in all, it was a really good day out here in Altoona and going to be uh, starting tomorrow. A different project, a whole different day. Anyways, this is Rewired Iowa, signing off for a night. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we have another satisfied customer. He's pretty happy. Uh, as you heard, he'll definitely recommend us again. Got a good handshake out of the deal. And uh, if all goes well, he says he'll leave us another five-star review since he's uh, found us out on the internet by that route. Hopefully, uh, me and Nate will do more projects with this uh, customer in the future. And by all means, we're gonna be going at it another time at another day. Everyone, peace out, have a good one.